Chapter 71 Breakthrough The Eight Desolate Sword Intent You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 71 Breakthrough The Eight Desolate Sword Intent Victor swept through the competitions and defeated many disciples of the Heavenly Sword Mountain. Many of the audience happened to be disciples of the Heavenly Sword Mountain, so they naturally wanted to see Victor lose. Those who maintained a complete victory along the way were always envied. Moreover, Victor came from an external sect. He was like a country bumpkin who had climbed onto the head of a noble. Naturally, this made the disciples of the Heavenly Sword Mountain unhappy. Let me show you the ultimate skill of my sword forging peak, the Yin and Yang throw. Su Lang shouted, and then the black copper furnace above his head flew into the sky. It grew in the wind, and in the blink of an eye, it grew to two meters in size. Once the furnace was filled with spiritual energy and smashes downwards, even copper and iron walls would be smashed into pieces. Victor did not care about what Su Lang was doing. While the other party was accumulating energy, he was not idle either. A cold sword light gleamed in his eyes. The Eight Desolate Sword Intent Bang! Su Lang's face was pale as if he had been hit by a heavy blow. The bronze furnace in the air lost control and crashed heavily on the ground, leaving a big hole in the ground. Damn it, why is it still like this? My spiritual power is obviously so powerful. How can his sword force still affect me? Su Lang was gasping for breath, one of his hands was on the ground. Final Determination Su Lang stared at Victor, a light flashed in his eyes. The copper furnace suddenly lit up and was about to fly up again, but before it could fly more than one meter, it crashed on the ground. The fierce sword intent in Victor's eyes burst out again. Su Lang felt a sharp light slash across his body, and his eyes instantly lost their spirit. He fell to the ground with a plop. Victor wins. Following the referee's announcement, the audience was dumbfounded. How could this sword forging peak disciple Su Lang lose? Moreover, it was a clear defeat. How was it possible? Wang Tsang lost. Although the people were surprised, Wang Tsang was only an external disciple. How could he be compared to the disciples of the Heavenly Sword Mountain? Moreover, Su Lang's major was sword forging, and his mental strength was extremely strong. How could he have the same outcome as Wang Tsang? What was Victor's background? The spectating disciples felt a chill down their spines. He had used his sword force to defeat his opponent one after another, regardless of the opponent's cultivation and strength, regardless of the opponent's spiritual power. They all had their battle ended within a few breaths. Victor's talent in swordsmanship gave people a feeling that he was unrivaled. In truth, Victor had been a little afraid of this guy. After all, his opponent was the type that could restrain him. However, after countless practice, his sword force had almost reached perfection, and he had even comprehended a trace of sword intent. After all, he was also constantly growing. If one said that sword force was constructed by unlimited power, then, in the end, it would be able to defeat the opponent in one strike. As for sword intent, it was to throw away all the excess sword force and condense the essence into one point, so as to break the surface with a point. Therefore, no matter how strong one's mental power was, there would still be a flaw. As long as one managed to capture this flaw, it would be effective against the opponent. This kind of subtle difference was very difficult for ordinary people to perceive. Even the person who was attacked would lose consciousness in an instant. Following that, their consciousness would gradually blur and they would not be able to detect what kind of attack it was. However, at this moment in the main hall, Yi Ling Yun could faintly sense that Victor's sword attack was slightly different from before. As for where it was exactly, she could only make a judgment after personally experiencing it. This youth is getting more and more interesting. Perhaps the first elder had underestimated him. The corners of Yi Ling Yun's mouth curled up slightly. She knew that her trip this time was not in vain. 
the group competition was proceeding in a steady manner. There were no heavyweight duels, and half of them were battles where there was a great disparity in strength. Just like that, Victor advanced with complete victory. Similarly, Ji Mengyun and Guo Feibai also advanced with complete victory. Song Qianqian stopped at the group competition due to insufficient wins. The next day, sword control peak. A new day, new competitions. Compared to yesterday, there are lesser matches today, but they would be much more intense. The competition was still arranged by the referee. According to the performance of the contestants, they would be regrouped. Those who had already competed would not compete again, and the strong seated contestants would not meet in advance. Victor was assigned to the seventh group. Dot the strong contestant who belonged to the same group as him was the personal disciple of the peak master of spirit spell peak, Huang Qi. Other than that, there was also Ji Menyun from Illusionary Sword Peak. Every disciple had to participate in a round of competition. This time, the battle between Victor and Ji Mengyun was inevitable. A battle between two strong competitors like Victor and Ji Mengyun also existed in other groups. When the time comes, there would be a round.robin competition where the results would be determined by points. Whether or not they could become famous with one battle, it would be another matter. At that time, unless they were the personal disciples of the peak masters, there was no way to hide their strength. Everyone had to go all out to fight for their points and obtain a high ranking. One could imagine the intensity of the competitions. The first round, Jiang Wang vs. Ding Ling. Following the announcement of the referee, a handsome young man wearing strange clothes performed a movement technique and landed on the stage. Song Qianqian was slightly startled, she whispered to Victor, I've asked around. That man is called Jiang Wang the younger brother of the two brothers of the Ueluan sect. They are known as Gemini stars in the Ueluan sect. Their status is equivalent to that of the Grand Elder, second only to the sect leader. Seeing Jiang Wang on the stage, many people in the arena were in an uproar, especially some of the female disciples. They were obviously very curious about the outer disciples with such style. As the referee announced the start of the match, everyone was discussing and looking at the ring curiously. Why is Jiang Wang the only one? Where did his opponent go? Song Qianqian was also very confused and looked around the ring in a daze. Victor smiled and said, Ding Ling has already entered the ring. Otherwise, the referee wouldn't have called for the match to begin. Her talent allows her to remain hidden in the crowd's perspective. Ordinary people can't see her. Chapter 72 The Strongest Competition Zone, Where the Strong Gathered You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 72 The Strongest Competition Zone, Where the Strong Gathered What, even this can work? Song Qianqian was stunned. Wasn't this the invisibility spell? At this moment, a cold voice sounded, this Ding Ling is a genius disciple of Illusionary Sword Peak. I heard that she can manipulate light and deceive the opponent's eyes. In the last competition, Ding Ling was ranked 49th. Now that three years have passed, she has a high chance of making it into the top 30. Victor turned his head and saw that the person who spoke was Guo Feibai. Although he did not have much contact with him, Victor could roughly feel that Guo Feibai was a person with extremely high standards. A person who could earn his praise could be considered a genius. Victor smiled, this is interesting. The first round is a showdown between the strong. The second stage of the competition is indeed filled with experts. Guo Feibai looked at Victor in surprise. Your group is quite strong, but you seem to be very confident in yourself. In Victor's group, the stronger opponents were Ji Mengyun, Jiang Wang, Ding Ling, Huang Qi, and Victor. There were five in total. Five people fighting for three spots. Huang Qi, as the personal disciple of the spirit spell Peak's Peak Master, definitely took one spot, which meant that there were only two spots left. The competition was so intense that Guo Feibai thought Victor would look solemn, 
but he didn't expect Victor to smile. Either he was very confident in his own strength, or he wanted to give up fighting for the first team. Hua Feibai felt that it should be the former. Jiang Wang and Ding Ling, who do you think will win? Victor asked Guo Feibai. Guo Feibai shook his head. They didn't show their true strength in the previous matches, and they had won all matches and qualified. I can't predict it. On average, there were four people who qualified in each group. Victor's group had Huang Qi, Ji Mengyun, Jiang Wang, Ding Ling, and Victor. There were five people in total. However, after this match, only two people would be able to maintain a winning streak. While the two of them were talking, the battle had already begun. This was an extremely strange battle. The audience could not see where Ding Ling was. They could only see the dazzling blade lights that dazzled their eyes. Victor could see Ding Ling's movements clearly with the sword intent that he had just developed. Ding Ling waved her hand, and five blades were shot out. These blades seemed to have been shot out casually, but in fact, each of them contained enough power to instantly kill an ordinary fifth-level spirit-gathering realm cultivator. Because of their fast speed, the blades left a series of afterimages. The sharp whistling sound made people's scalps go numb. Controlling the power of light is really amazing. Victor could clearly sense that although the main body of the blades was spiritual power, they did indeed contain a rich power of light. This was an even rarer attribute than metal, wood, water, fire, and earth. In the blink of an eye, there were already 27 blades gleaming in the air. These blades danced recklessly in the air, but they did not attack Jiang Wan. At this moment, Ding Ling suddenly clasped her hands together and chanted. These blades danced in the air as she gave the order. The 27 light blades changed directions and attacked Jiang Wang altogether. Faced with an attack that had no blind spots, Jiang Wang's hands were flat. As he slowly put his palms together, a gentle light blossomed from his palms, and a thick light shield that looked like an eggshell appeared around his body. Whoosh! 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 The blades shot into the thick light shield and were immediately met with a huge resistance. Their speed was greatly reduced, and at the same time, the sharp edges of the light blades were quickly melted by the light shield. Zen Thousand Illusion Hand Jiang Wan opened his hands, and the tips of his fingers were like flowers blooming. Countless fingerprints rushed in all directions. Ding Ling, who had been hiding under the distorted light, was forced out by Jiang Wang's attack. Her face was full of shock. You've lost. Jiang Wang's expression was as heavy as water, as if he was stating a fact. Then, he clenched his hands into fists, and a pair of golden fists appeared in front of him. Golden Light Chi Dot Stabilizing Fist. Boom. The huge golden fist print hit Ding Ling's body. Ding Ling hurriedly raised the long sword in her hands to block it, and spat out a mouthful of blood. The long sword was broken, and Ding Ling's body was sent flying, crashing heavily into the protective barrier. Jiang Wang wins. Following the referee's announcement, the audience did not have time to react. From the beginning of the match to the end of the match, it only took less than three minutes. Jiang Wang only used three moves, one of which was to defend, one was to test, and one was to attack. After three moves, Ding Ling was defeated, and Jiang Wang never moved an inch. His expression was as calm as ever. Ding Ling was not a nobody. She had been selected as a core disciple by Illusionary Sword Peak since she was young, and her talent was shocking. She was ranked 49th in the last grand competition, and was in the top 50. No one had expected that she would lose to an outside sect disciple this time. Moreover, she had lost within three moves. This Jiang Wang was too strong. Guo Feibai raised his eyebrows. He would not be surprised if Jiang Wang or Ding Ling won. What surprised him was that Jiang Wang won by an overwhelming advantage. This proved that Jiang Wang and Ding Ling were not on the same level at all. 
If Jiang Wan could make it into the top ten as a disciple of an external sect, it would be enough for him to leave his own glorious deeds in the history of the Heavenly Sword Mountain. Moreover, Jiang Wang had a twin brother, Jiang Yun. Jiang Yun's strength should not be much weaker than Jiang Wang's. It was unbelievable that a small overseas Yueluan sect suddenly had two gifted disciples who were comparable to the disciples of the Heavenly Sword Mountain. Guo Feibai could not help but glance at Victor, but noticed that Victor's expression was still indifferent. It was obvious that he was very confident in his own strength, and was not worried about encountering those powerful opponents. What a confident fellow! The ancient mystic realm Heavenly Sword Mountain was indeed worthy. As expected, there were geniuses everywhere. This grand competition was interesting. The second round, Huang Qi vs. Zhou Yen. Hearing Huang Qi's name, Victor could not help but pay attention. This heavenly sword mountain was divided into seven peaks. They were the Sword Control Peak, Illusionary Sword Peak, Sword Forging Peak, Molten Spirit Peak, Spirit Spell Peak, Heavenly Sound Peak, and Puppet Peak. Among them, the Sword Control Peak was the strongest. The other six peaks all had their own strengths. For example, the Illusionary Sword Peak, Spirit Spell Peak, and Puppet Peak's attacking methods were extremely strange. There were unique moves emerging one after another. Compared to the straightforward sword control peak, the disciples of these peaks were more difficult to deal with. Among the seven peaks, Victor was the most interested in the spirit spell peak. After all, compared to the other sects, only the spirit spell peak did not need any additional medium. Unfortunately, there was no good opportunity to download the skills now. These skills were not as simple as those martial arts skills from the past. Victor even began to consider whether he should join the Spirit Spell Peak if he really entered the Heavenly Sword Mountain in the future. Zhou Yen used a defensive martial skill at the beginning of the competition, adding layer after layer of earth attribute rock shield on his body. No one laughed at his cowardice. In fact, it required great courage to be able to compete with the personal disciples of one of the seven peak masters. Zhou Yen himself was not a nobody. In the previous ranking, he was ranked 66th. This time, he had only lost one round in the group competition. Although the chance of entering the first team was slim, it was definitely no problem for him to enter the second team. Chapter 73 The Showdown Between the Strong Victor's First Battle You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. Chapter 73 The Showdown Between the Strong Victor's First Battle Fire of the Sun Zhou Yan had already reached the limit in terms of defense. He immediately brought out his trump card. As a disciple of the Sword Forging Peak, almost every disciple had a fire attribute spirit root. At the same time, they mainly used fire attribute techniques. This fire of the sun was activated from the sunlight technique. In the next moment, this fire of the sun actually produced a fire phoenix. Although everyone could not feel the heat of the fire phoenix due to the protective barrier, they could feel that the power of the fire phoenix was not to be underestimated just by looking at the distorted light around the fire. However, Huang Qi only raised his right hand and drew a few golden runes in the air, forming a strange spell in the air. Then, an unbelievable scene happened. The fire phoenix rushed into the spell and disappeared completely like a clay ox entering the sea. It was as if the spell formed by the golden runes was connected to another space, directly transferring the fire phoenix to another space. Seeing such a strange scene, Zhou Yen sighed in despair and said, I admit defeat. The fire of the sun was already his strongest move, but in front of Huang Qi, it couldn't even cause a spark. It disappeared into thin air. This made Zhou Yen feel helpless. The gap was too big, so much so that he couldn't even estimate how much of Huang Qi's strength had been used. Huang Qi wins. The outcome of this battle was not surprising at all. People praised Huang Qi's strength, and then began to wait for the next match. Victor had been thinking about a problem. A small spell could actually have such great power. 
He felt that this kind of spells and the heavenly sword mountain's great spells could be said to be two different aspects. In Victor's opinion, compared to Huang Qi's spells, the heavenly sword mountain spells were more mysterious, and it was more useful to him. At this moment, the referee's voice interrupted Victor's thoughts. The third match, Victor vs. Ji Menyun. Victor raised his head and met Ji Menyun's gaze. At this moment, Ji Menyun looked at Victor with a smile sweet as a flower. It was obvious that she was quite interested in Victor. The battle between Victor and Ji Menyun was another heavyweight match. This meant that one more person would be eliminated from this group. This scene attracted a lot of attention. Not only was it due to Victor's shocking strength, it was also related to the determination of the person who would be the winner amongst disciples of the outside sect. Previously, when Jiang Wang defeated Ding Ling, the odds of Jiang Wang winning the title of number one in the outer sect had been raised to 1 to 1. His brother's odds had also been reduced to 1 to 1.4. This time, those who hadn't bought the two brothers from the Ueloan sect were regretful, while those who had already bought it were beaming with joy. The 1 to 1 odds weren't worth much money, but there were still many people who placed their bets on Jiang Wang. Victor's odds had also risen to 1 to 6. Although he was also one of the favorites to win the championship, the gap between him and the two brothers from the Ueloan sect was still big. This time, Victor's battle with Ji Mengyun was an extremely important one. It could greatly predict the disciple who would be the first in the outside world. Ji Mengyun's strength was unquestionably superior to Ding Ling's. As for who was stronger, her and Jiang Wang, the majority would still support Jiang Wang. If Victor could not win against Ji Mengyun, he would basically lose the qualification to be the first however, Victor's strength was only at the ninth level of the spirit gathering realm, while Ji Mengyun's strength was already at the twelfth level of the spirit gathering realm. The difference in strength between the two was three realms. Could Victor really win? Not to mention the general audience who didn't think highly of Victor, even Song Chanchan didn't dare to believe that Victor could win. Victor, I've been looking forward to this battle for a long time. It's a pity that I missed the chance to compete against you in the group competition. Ji Mingyun's heroic face was smiling like a flower. She narrowed his eyes and glanced at Song Chanchan below the stage. She said softly, Your admirer seems to be very worried about your battle this time. I'm happy to let her feel disappointed. I also feel that it's such a pity that I missed the group battle with you. As for my junior sister, don't worry. She won't be disappointed. Victor had nothing to worry about in this battle. His technique wasn't limited to the eight desolate sword. Hearing this, the audience was speechless. Victor was really confident. Ji Mengyun was ranked in the top three of the illusionary sword P. With the strength of the twelfth level of the spirit gathering realm, she could even fight against a disciple at the thirteenth level of the spirit gathering realm. In this competition, Ji Mengyun was very likely to enter the top fifteen. As for Victor, the only ability he had been displaying was his powerful sword force. However, how long could he last with just one technique? Ji Mengyun burst out laughing and said, It seems that you are very confident. Let me tell you, I know sword force as well. I just don't know who has the stronger sword force between us. Victor smiled faintly and said, I wasn't sure at first, but looking at your condition, my confidence is much higher. Oomph, arrogant. Ji Mengyun snorted, and the scene around them suddenly changed. The audience disappeared, and Victor and Ji Mengyun appeared in an endless field, with soft grass under their feet. My illusionary sword peak secret skill, the illusionary grassland, combined with my unique sword force, I'll see how you can block it. Illusionary attacks were a type of spiritual attack, and sword force was also a spiritual attack. However, in the illusionary space, the caster was invincible strength-wise. As long as she could control it, whatever she imagined would come true. And for people trapped in the environment, once they assumed that they were dead, they would fall into a deep sleep, which was equivalent to a living dead. Die. Ji Mengyun shouted loudly. 
Under her feet, the green grass rapidly grew into countless long snakes. Snake bite. Ji Mengyun willed, and countless long snakes swept towards Victor like waves. Hiss, hiss, hiss. Countless fangs with a cold gleam gradually approached Victor's position. Was it a competition between mental strength? The battle between illusion and sword aura was exactly what Victor had been looking forward to. He had been constantly polishing his sword force these past few days, and he had even developed a trace of sword intent. Now that he had a better opportunity to polish his sword intent, he naturally wouldn't miss it. Victor closed his eyes and opened them, then a sharp sword light appeared in Victor's eyes. In the next moment, countless grass snakes in the illusionary world were cut in half by a single blow. The entire grassland was sliced apart by the sword light. Eh. What? Just as Ji Mengyun reacted, she felt her brain shake. In the blink of an eye, her world was on the verge of collapsing. Countless world fragments surged into her mind, and her mental world was on the verge of collapsing. Chapter 74 Terrifying Concept, The Ice Domain You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. Chapter 74 Terrifying Concept, The Ice Domain Boom! The environment shattered, and everything turned into nothingness. The brilliant starry sky above their heads, and the black earth beneath their feet. Eight desolate sword sweep. Victor's eyes flashed, and his sword force suddenly erupted. It rushed towards Ji Mengyun, completely shattering her body. However, Ji Mengyun's shattered body turned into countless fireflies, flying in various directions. The fireflies filled the sky like ghostly flames. After a few breaths, all the fireflies gathered together and turned into a huge green fireball. The fireball was like a meteorite heading straight for Victor's mental world. Scram! Endless coldness burst out of Victor's eyes. The world seemed to be frozen. Victor's right hand held the sky, and a huge ice dragon flew out of his hand and headed straight for the fireball in the distance. The extreme cold power of the phaseless finger could very well resist such a fire attack. It would do no harm to Victor at all. Frozen World Ji Mengyun was shocked. This was an absolute defensive method. Unless one's mental power could crush the frozen world, no one could enter it. Why? Wasn't his technique sword force? How could he have such a powerful ice domain? An unexpected situation occurred. Ji Mengyun couldn't help but feel a sense of fear. Her main offensive technique was to rely on illusion. Now that illusion couldn't do damage to her opponent, this meant that Victor would be in an undefeatable position. A battle of mental strength was occurring at this moment. Once a trace of doubt and fear appeared in her heart, it would be a huge flaw. Victor, who was already fluent in controlling mental strength, immediately sensed a gap in Ji Mingyun's defense. Eight desolate sword intent. Dot, no way, I went to the toilet and came back. Why are these two still standing still there? Yeah, are they competing or not? Are you guys idiots? The competition has started. Do you know what an illusion is? Bullsh asterisk t illusion. I can't see anything. It's not interesting at all. A disciple from one of the ten great cultivation families left after saying that. He had already been eliminated anyway. He would rather watch an intense battle. He didn't care who won or lost. However, not everyone was like this disciple. There were quite a few illusionary sword peak disciples present, they came to watch Ji Mengyun's battle. Although Ji Mengyun wasn't the strongest disciple in her generation of the illusionary sword peak disciples, but her attainments in illusion construction and mental attacks were one of the highest level. It could be said that Victor and Ji Mengyun's mental power showdown symbolized Victor's battle against the top disciple of the younger generation in the Heavenly Sword Peak. If Ji Mengyun lost, no one in her generation of the Heavenly Sword Peak could surpass Victor in mental power abilities. This was definitely something that the illusionary sword peak would feel embarrassed about. 
They had the best cultivation technique and the best master. They had grown up eating spiritual grains, had access to all kinds of resources, but in the end, they had lost to a cultivator from the countryside. It was really inexcusable. In the illusionary realm, because of the momentary hesitation, Ji Minyan's mind had a slight flaw. Victor had seized the opportunity and pursued her fiercely. Boom! Countless illusions rushed into Ji Minyan's mind, and Ji Minyan was sucked into the endless whirlpool of fragments. The battle between mental powers was extremely dangerous. One wrong move and she would lose the battle. Her mental powers were rapidly depleted, and Ji Minyan's face was pale. This kid's mental powers are actually so strong. Ji Mengyun was a disciple of Illusionary Sword Peak, and she had specially practiced condensation of mental powers. However, compared to Victor, she was actually inferior. One had to know that Ji Mengyun's cultivation was three realms higher than Victor's. Fortunately, this guy's attack method is simple, and he completely lacked the techniques of using spiritual power. Every attack will waste a lot of his spiritual power. Ji Mingyun's thoughts raced. As she resisted Victor's attack, she thought about the possibility of winning. I have been on the defensive side. Although Victor's spiritual power is strong, he doesn't know how to use techniques. Every attack will waste a large amount of spiritual power. In addition, I had been focusing on defense, so I have been saving energy. His mental strength consumption rate is about three times faster than mine. As long as I can withstand this round of attacks from him, he will definitely lose. Ji Mengyun thought so. The corners of her mouth curled up into a sneer. After all, he was a cultivator from the countryside. He only had brute force and didn't know any techniques. He was destined to lose in her hands. Ji Mengyun never thought that her thoughts were in line with Victor's. Victor had been using the Eight Desolate Sword Force since the start of the competition, all for the sake of comprehending the Eight Desolate Sword intent. An opponent like Ji Mengyun, whose strength was close to his, was skilled in using spiritual power, and had good endurance was simply an opponent that could only be encountered and not sought for. To Victor, Ji Mengyun was an excellent whetstone. The illusory space changed again and again. From the grassland to the sky, from the sky to hell. Ji Mengyun was either surrounded by flying birds or wandering souls. These spirits and ghosts were all visualized by Ji Mengyun to protect her mental world. However, under Victor's unparalleled sword intent, they were continuously shattered. The two of them stood on the arena for an hour, not moving at all. Ji Mingyun's face was already as pale as a sheet. An hour of high dot intensity energy consumption was not something an ordinary person could endure. If not for Ji Mingyun's talent and solid foundation, she would have long collapsed. How is this possible? Is this fellow really human? Ji Mingyun could not imagine that the other party was actually able to persist until now at three times the rate of spiritual energy consumption. If it were her, she would have long collapsed. If I hold on for a little longer, he won't be able to hold on. In the end, I'll be the winner. Victor was indeed like what Ji Mengyun had said. He had been on the offensive all these while, and he had exhausted a lot of his mental strength. He relied on the top dot tier wood element cultivation technique, the tree building technique, to complement his wood attribute heavenly spirit root. Moreover, he had already maxed out on this cultivation technique a few months ago, and his recovery rate was at the highest speed. Although the tree building technique could only be considered as an ordinary cultivation technique in the later stages, but in the early stages, it was the best of the best. However, even so, three times the consumption of Ji Mengyun's spiritual power resulted in him feeling a little uncomfortable. His complexion wasn't any better than Ji Mengyun's. The reason Victor would grit his teeth and persevere in his attacks until now was because of the benefits. In such a high dot intensity battle, he had obtained visible improvements, and his understanding of sword intent was becoming more and more profound. He felt that it wouldn't be long before he could completely replace the sword force with sword intent. 
the two of them stood on the arena for an hour without any breaks, even the spectators around them were at a loss. The illusory sword peak disciples were still fine. After all, they were used to this kind of fighting style. Moreover, the result of the competition concerned their illusory sword peak's reputation, so they would naturally be patient and watch. Chapter 75 Victor's Plan, The Initial Success of His Sword Intent You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 75 Victor's Plan, The Initial Success of His Sword Intent As for the others, they had long lost their patience. Some had already left the arena, while others were already asleep. Victor can't seem to hold on any longer. In a duel between sword force and illusion, it was impossible for outsiders to see who had the upper hand in the process of the duel, and neither could they see what kind of exchange there was in the duel. They could only rely on their external behavior to differentiate. Ji Mingyun's situation was slightly better than Victor's. Well, it's incredible that a cultivator from an external sect could do this. But that's it. At least we managed to barely retain our illusionary sword peak's dignity. Victor's body obviously trembled and the two illusionary sword peak disciples were talking. Ji Mingyun's face was as pale as paper, but she was still barely able to stand. We're going to win. Finally. Something doesn't seem right, the illusionary sword peak disciple who had spoken earlier frowned. This Victor had held on for too long. That shouldn't be it. Could it be that the other party had a supreme dot grade spirit amplification technique? That was absolutely impossible. He immediately rejected this absurd idea. If there really was such a secret technique, wouldn't the cultivator's spirit energy be endless? Of course, he would not have figured that Victor's shaking just now was just to give his body a break. He just needed to rest for a while. After all, it had been too long and he was almost numb. He had to move a little. At this moment, the female disciple beside him pointed and said in a low voice, Senior Sister G, her nose is bleeding. Ha! Huh. He turned around and saw that Ji Minyun's nose had two red streams of blood. It had already passed her mouth and dripped down her chin. Oh no! Stop the match! The opponent is doing this on purpose. At this moment, Ji Mingyun's body swayed and she fell to the ground with a thud. Victor wins. Following the referee's announcement, most of the audience only had one reaction, that this boring match was finally over. From the start of the match, the two of them had been staring at each other for more than an hour. Could there be a more boring competition than this? A few disciples of Illusionary Sword Peak ran to the stage. At this time, Ji Mingyun's face was pale, her eyes were bloodshot, and her nostrils were bleeding. She had lost consciousness. Bring her away. A female disciple who looked to be in her twenties waved her hand. She did not have a good impression of Ji Mingyun. However, she was, after all, one of the top three core disciples in the younger generation of the illusionary sword peak. She took a deep look at Victor, hoping to find some side effects from using the secret technique. However, she was disappointed. She did not believe that there were no side effects from the secret technique, so there was only one explanation. The other party had spare energy all along. He had only pretended to be mentally exhausted to lure Ji Mengyun to fight him. The woman's face turned cold. You could have won long ago, but you deliberately let Ji Mengyun fight you to such extent. Victor was about to turn around and leave, but when he heard the woman's question, he stopped and looked back at the woman. He did not deny it. Victor smiled faintly and said, You can think whatever you want, but if the person lying on the ground was me, your junior sister would probably be happy to make me even more miserable. I didn't hit her hard at all, but she ended up like this. Is it the aftereffects of using some kind of secret technique? It's just a competition, and she would rather use a secret technique with side effects to deal with me. Why are you questioning me instead? The woman's expression froze, and she couldn't refute at all. Seeing that the woman was speechless, Victor shook his head helplessly. 
I didn't force her to use any secret technique. She brought it up upon herself. Yet you blame me for harming her. Is this the logic of your heavenly sword mountain's illusory sword peak? You are allowed to oppress others but others aren't allowed to go against you. The woman gritted her teeth and said, it was clearly you who had ulterior motives to lure Ji Mengyun into such a situation. It's meaningless for us to play the game of words here. After entering the finals, you will meet illusionary sword Peak's personal disciple, junior sister Huan, Huan Shaodai. I hope that when the time comes, you can fight like a man. Don't admit defeat before even fighting. When the time comes, it's not certain who will win. Victor turned around and walked off the stage. The surrounding audience made way for Victor. In fact, in the eyes of most people, Victor's performance in this battle was very average. The main reason was that the battle lasted for too long. It took him more than an hour to barely defeat Ji Mengyun. During this time, Victor's face was pale and he trembled. Therefore, everyone felt that his victory was not easy. Victor's strength was considered to be slightly higher than Ji Mingyun's. With this strength, how would he fare against Jiang Wang? The betting odds were 1.7 to Jiang Wang, 3 to Jiang Yun, and 4 to Victor. Because of the battle between Victor and Ji Mingyun, Jiang Wang's odds had increased while Victor's odds had decreased. However, in general, the majority was still optimistic about Jiang Wang. After all, Jiang Wang had always maintained his composure. There wasn't even an opponent who could force him to move. Who knew how much of his strength he had used against Ding Ling? Victor seemed to have reached his limit against Ji Mengyun. Unless he still had a trump card in that situation, the probability of him winning against Jiang Wang wasn't high. After the five of the contestants with a winning streak exchanged blows one by one, there wasn't much to see in the remaining few people's matches. Although those who could advance in the first round were all experts, they were still far from the previous few players. The group competition soon moved on to the second round. Huang Qi was the first to go on stage. His opponent was Ding Ling. For Huang Qi, whether it was Zhou Yan or Ding Ling, there was no difference at all to him. After one move, his opponent was instantly defeated. Dot, Huang Qi wins. The referee announced. Ding Ling sighed sadly. She had hoped to enter the first team, but now she had lost two matches in a row. If nothing unexpected happened, she would still lose to that guy called Victor in a few rounds. The second match of the second round, the referee paused deliberately at this point. All the players present paid attention to this because the matches were all arranged by the referee team according to the performance of the players. Therefore, the players didn't know who they would face. The second match, Victor vs. Jiang Wan. As soon as these words were said, the entire stadium was in an uproar. Victor going against Jiang Wan was definitely the most interesting match. Ding Ling and Ji Mengyun, who had maintained a complete victory before, had already lost. Only Huang Qi, Jiang Wan, and Victor were left with a complete victory. Whether it was Huang Qi vs. Jiang Wang or Huang Qi vs. Victor, there was actually nothing interesting to watch. In everyone's eyes, Huang Qi's victory was without any suspense. A personal disciple was too strong, and his cultivation was at the twelfth level of spirit condensation. No one could phase him. The most interesting and suspenseful match was still between Jiang Wang and Victor. In the eyes of most people, Based on the current situation, the winner of this match had 70 to 30 probability, Jiang Wang was 70, and Victor was 30. The real situation would only be known after the fight. Jiang Wang's strange clothes fluttered in the wind. He stood on the stage and looked calmly at Victor. Chapter 76 The Battle for First Place Among the External Sects You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 76 The Battle for First Place Among the External Sects Yueluan Sect Disciple Jiang Wang He nodded and introduced himself. Victor from the Qinyan Sect, please advise me. 
Victor casually cupped his fists and saluted. The two strong fighters faced each other, and the seemingly calm arena seemed to be filled with invisible sparks. You are very strong, but my cultivation method is special. Your moves are ineffective against me. After the match began, Jiang Wang and Victor did not fight immediately. After looking at each other for a while, Jiang Wang slowly opened his mouth and said. Then, a layer of hazy yet tough golden halo condensed around his body, which looked like a thick golden shell. Victor did not have any reaction when he saw this eggshell. Ding Ling, who was watching the match below the stage, let out a deep breath. She had experienced the power of this shell before. Ding Ling was very confident in the combined power of her 27 light blades. However, after she struck into this shell, she felt as if all of her strength was stuck in a mud puddle and was unable to free herself. Her energy was quickly exhausted. Victor smiled faintly and closed his eyes before opening them again. Initial success stage, eight desolate sword intent burst forth. This attack used 70% of Victor's strength. When he fought with Ji Menyun back then, Victor still held back, making the other party think that he could not hold on any longer. He had lured the other party to use a secret technique to increase her mental strength. After that, he held on for a period of time in order to better polish his eight desolate sword intent. However, since the other party dared to say such words, it seemed that Jiang Wang was very confident in his defensive barrier. There was no need for him to be anxious. Xiu. The sharp spiritual energy in the sword intent collided violently with the golden shell, causing it to distort violently. The golden shell seemed to be disrupted by a violent storm, swaying aggressively. It looked as if it was going to break at any moment, but it did not. The surrounding arenas were affected by the golden shell. The bricks under Jiang Wang's feet shattered, forming cracks that looked like spider webs. However, Jiang Wang, who was at the center of the golden shell, remained calm and composed. The intense reaction on the golden shell and the calmness within the shell formed a sharp contrast, causing many other cultivators to look at him in surprise. Metal and Earth Elements Victor sensed that the shell contained the sturdiness of the earth element and the toughness of the metal element. The two powerful spiritual powers helped to completely block Victor's sword intent attack. Yes, I am a cultivator with three spiritual roots. My affinity with the earth and metal elements had reached 80%. The earth element's spiritual power, which is known for its defensive power, and the indestructible metal element spiritual power to form a protective shield. This is my absolute defense. Jiang Wang's voice was not loud, but it was clearly heard by everyone. 80% affinity. No wonder Jiang Wang could fight all the way until now. His cultivation method has fully displayed his spirit root talent. With such an ability, unless Victor's talent was stronger than Jiang Wang and possessed matching cultivation methods and skills, it will be difficult to break his defense. If he can't break through his protective barrier, then Jiang Wang will be in an undefeatable position. Victor's sword attack is ineffective, how can they fight? Who asked you to bet on Victor? Can't you bet on Jiang Wang? You must be greedy. Sword attack is not a conventional method. The fact that Victor made it this far with his sword attack was already considered good. Many of his opponents have lost because they couldn't see his weakness. Now that they have encountered a being that can counter him, it would be normal for Victor to lose. Within the golden shell, Jiang Wang conjured a spell in his hand. A hazy golden halo enveloped his hands like a Buddha that bathed in bright golden light. Is your attack over? Then. It's my turn. Since the attack was ineffective, Victor withdrew his sword intent attack and smiled. You must be really confident to announce before attacking. Jiang Wang said while forming a seal, we are fighting, not fighting to death. Moreover, my attack is very difficult to dodge. Even if I told you, you wouldn't be able to dodge it. Jiang Wang had a calm personality. He was not a person who liked to boast about his strength. If he said that Victor couldn't dodge the attack, then it meant that he couldn't dodge it. 
His fingers became faster and faster while forming seals, and it soon became completely blurry. In the short span of two breaths, he had formed a seal several hundreds of times. Zen Thousand Illusion Hand Jiang Wan opened his hands. The tips of his fingers were like blossoming flowers, or like a thousand-dot-handed guanine. Countless golden phantoms shot out from all directions, blotting out the sky and covering the earth. In the blink of an eye, Victor was surrounded by countless golden handprints. Countless air-dot-piercing sounds brushed past Victor's ears. These phantoms seemed to have only a few hundred layers, but in reality, there were at least thousands of overlapping handprints. No wonder this technique was called the Zen Thousand Illusion Hand. As expected, the technique lived up to its name. When the audience below the stage saw this move, they cried out in surprise. No wonder he said he couldn't dodge it, how can he possibly dodge it? Ding Ling had experienced this move before, and she was hit almost instantly. Her invisibility spell was broken, and then she was defeated by Jiang Wang's golden light chi. Stabilizing Fist Ding Ling knew how powerful this move was. It didn't give anyone a chance to resist. Facing the thousand shadows of the Zen Thousand Illusion Hand, unless it was someone like Huang Qi who had the ability to easily block it, otherwise, how could he dodge it? Ding Ling didn't think it was possible. Gather. Jian Wang put his hands together, and all the shadows attacked Victor. A smile appeared on Victor's face. Dot max level tree building technique, activate. Max level wind spell, unleash. Whoosh. 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 In an instant, Victor was hit by countless hand shadows. The hand shadows passed through Victor's body and flew into the floor tiles. The floor tiles were filled with holes and gravel flew everywhere. Before the audience could cry out in surprise, Victor's figure had already disappeared. It turned out to be just an afterimage. There. A member of the audience cried out in surprise and pointed at the sky. Everyone looked in the direction of the voice, but they only saw a blurry shadow. A series of afterimages covered the sky, and it was impossible to tell which was the real Victor. Victor's body was like a violent wind. The wind technique was enhanced by the max level tree building divine technique, so it should be considered a violent wind technique. At the same time, after the transformation of his sword force, his sword intent had broken through to the initial success stage. His spiritual power became even more boundless, and his senses are sharper. Jiang Wang was controlling a thousand handprints at the same time. These hand shadows appeared one after another. Victor made use of the gaps between these hand shadows, and like a fish swimming in a stormy sea, he swam back and forth. With the support of the power of wind, his movement became faster and faster. Many times, the audience thought that he had reached a dead end and could no longer dodge. However, what the handprints pierced through in the end were only the afterimages left behind by Victor. The audience gasped in surprise. Impacts of such extreme speed collision was an unusual visual feast for them. Chapter 77 The Power of the Mighty Palms You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. Chapter 77 The Power of the Mighty Palms What a fast speed! Even Yi Lingyun, who was in the main hall, was instantly alarmed. It was simply unbelievable for a 15.year.old youth to execute his movement technique at such a speed. Over a thousand hand shadows moved as fast as lightning, and it was also man.made. The attacks were very concentrated, and there was no pattern of attack. In order to appear to be at ease in such attacks, one must not only keep up with the speed, but also have keen perception and strong judgment. Whoosh! 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 In such a violent storm of energy, Victor actually fought against all the attacks and closed in on Jian Wang's side. Jian Wang finally lost his usual calmness. His eyes were filled with disbelief. What was he trying to do? Thinking that he still had absolute defense, Jian Wang felt slightly relieved. 
At this moment, the rapidly moving victor suddenly raised his palm. A strong defense would indeed make many cultivators feel troubled, but it was not a problem for Victor. Because between attributes, there would still be some restraint. As long as one's strength was strong enough, one could directly destroy the opponent's defense. Mighty Palms The movements of his body in his breathing were synchronized, and the spiritual power in Victor's body surged. The max level tree building technique gave rise to powerful spiritual power, coupled with the mighty palms with a metal dot type power. Victor suddenly rushed out, and his palm was like a fierce tiger descending from the mountain. Boom! The swift and fierce palm smashed heavily on the golden shell, and countless spiritual energy burst out. Crack! A series of glass dot like sounds could be heard. The golden shell, which was termed the absolute defense, was actually shattered into countless tiny pieces like broken glass. Facing the metal outer shell, Victor chose to use metal against metal and used metal attacks to deal with the metal defensive barrier. Seeing that his absolute defense was shattered by Victor's palm, Jiang Wang was completely stunned. How was this possible? Jiang Wang wasn't a person who liked to brag. He dared to call his defensive barrier absolute defense, so he naturally had something to back himself up. His golden shell was extremely tough, and when faced with a powerful attack, it would only transform, not shatter. But now, it didn't even transform, and directly shattered. If Victor had released a powerful martial technique that was his trump card which caused his defensive barrier to be directly crushed, he wouldn't be so surprised as he was now. However, Victor had only used one palm strike, and it was not a fierce palm technique. It was like a casual palm strike that did not even use a weapon. Could it be that Victor was originally a cultivator who practiced palm techniques? Sword force was only one of his talents. The current situation could not help but shock Jiang Wang. After Victor broke through the defense, he had already sent a punch toward his chest. Jiang Wang froze, his face extremely pale. At such a close distance, there was no time to use any martial arts. As for dodging with movement techniques. Not to mention that he was not good at movement techniques, no matter how fast the movement technique was, it was definitely not as fast as the movement technique that Victor used just now. That was a movement technique that could even dodge his Zen Thousand Illusion Hand. At the critical moment, Jiang Wang could only utilize his palm as a knife, and with one hand, he slashed at Victor's wrist. Although Jiang Wang looked thin and weak, and was a little shorter than Victor, it would be a mistake to underestimate his physical quality. Jiang Wang's earth and metal elemental spiritual powers were extremely compatible. Although he usually looked light and agile, once he had the support of his two types of spiritual powers, his body would be as strong as a spiritual weapon. Therefore, Jiang Wang did not use a weapon at all. His body was his best weapon. Jiang Wang originally wanted to use his hand knife to force Victor back, but he did not expect Victor to remain and continue attacking him. This guy. Jiang Wang was also furious. He gritted his teeth. His attack was merciless. If an ordinary cultivator was hit by this knife, at least their arms and legs would be broken. Clang. A blade landed on Victor's wrist. Jiang Wang's pupils instantly shrank. He only felt that his hand blade seemed to have struck steel. The other party's arm was fine. Even the bones of his own hand were about to crack. Was this guy human? Just as this thought flashed through his mind, Victor's fist had already arrived in front of him. Boom. Under the fierce attack, Jiang Wang was directly sent flying and heavily crashed into the field's protective barrier. Thanks for letting me win. Victor waved his hand, cupped his fists, and turned to leave. If he hadn't attacked just now and instead pulled out his sword, a bloody hole would have appeared in Jiang Wang's throat. Victor wins, the referee announced. This sudden change shocked the entire audience. What happened just now? Victor actually shattered Jiang Wang's absolute defense with one palm. It was just that simple palm. 
there weren't any strong spiritual fluctuations. People had analyzed Victor's battle against Jiang Wang, but no one had expected it. The final result actually turned out this way. Victor had easily defeated Jiang Wang. The entire match had only lasted for less than five minutes. Moreover, the way Victor defeated Jiang Wang was not with his best sword attack, but a palm technique that he had never used before. Doesn't Victor only know one sword attack? Why does he know palm techniques? Every cultivator wanted to improve, and they would learn from each other. After all, a person's energy was limited. If one wanted to achieve great results, they had to make some choices. They may be strong in certain aspects but would be weak in others. However, it seemed that Victor was not only good at sword attacks. If it was swordsmanship, the audience would not be too surprised. After all, swordsmanship and sword forces complemented each other. It was understandable. However, the difference between palm techniques and swordsmanship was still very big. It was really difficult to link the two together, not bad. Victor walked off the stage and Song Xiuwen praised. Although his voice was not loud, Song Xiuwen was still shocked. He thought Victor was not bad, but Victor's realm was still low. When he saw Zhang Zetian, the Jiang brothers, Guo Feibai and other talented disciples, Song Xiuwen was also a little shaken. But now it seemed that he had underestimated Victor. Victor could make it into the top 20, but he had not used his sword yet. In other words, he still had a trump card he hadn't used yet. So, Victor was very likely to enter the top 10. Thinking of this, Song Xiuwen became excited. Entering the top 10 meant that Victor's strength was comparable to the genius disciples of the Heavenly Sword Mountain. Song Xiuwen didn't dare to think about it. Victor's growth speed was too terrifying. He had a bad guess. After this competition, Victor was very likely to leave the Qinyin sect. After all, with Victor's talent and strength, the Qinyin sect was no longer of much help to him. It was not easy for him to nurture such a genius disciple, but in the blink of an eye, Victor could no longer stay. Song Xiuwen still felt a little depressed. Chapter 78 Prophecy The Chosen One You are listening at NovelFull.audio Chapter 78 Prophecy The Chosen One In the Main Hall Yi Ling Yun had been paying attention to this match from the beginning to the end. It seems that fellow Taoist is very interested in this youth. This disciple is not bad, he is a good seedling. Beside Yi Ling Yun, Heavenly Sword Mountain sect master Zhao Qing Tian laughed. Previously, Yi Ling Yun had only used her attention to secretly observe Victor. It was impossible for her to openly observe him like this. Zhao Qing Tian would have never figured that Yi Ling Yun was here for Victor, he only thought that Yi Ling Yun was attracted by Victor's stunning performance in the battle. He had also paid attention to Victor before. After all, to be able to fight to this extent at the ninth level of the spirit gathering realm, he was definitely not an ordinary genius disciple. Such external disciples were too eye dot catching. It was difficult not to notice them. However, although Zhao Qing Tian had noticed Victor, he had no understanding of Victor's information in detail. He only had a rough impression of Victor. A disciple who was not at a high realm and was good at sword force. It was obvious that this kind of disciple did not focus on cultivation and relied on his sword techniques. Yi Ling Yun glanced at Zhao Qing Tian and laughed in her heart. According to her guess, Zhao Qing Tian definitely did not understand Victor's true situation. She smiled and said, This youth is indeed a good seedling. To have such strength at such a young age, his future is limitless. Hearing Yi Ling Yun's high evaluation, Zhao Qing Tian was in a good mood. I didn't expect to see such a disciple in this competition. Such a good seedling, I must take him in as my disciple. Suddenly, Zhao Qing Tian seemed to have realized something. He used his spiritual power to send a message to the attendant beside him and said, Go and check the background of this disciple named Victor. 
Zhao Qingtian suddenly had a bad premonition. This victor couldn't be from an outside sect, right? The details were quickly sent back. Zhao Qingtian's premonition came true. Victor was indeed an outside sect disciple. He turned to look at Yi Lingyun, his expression somewhat unsightly. He naturally remembered that Yi Lingyun had asked which competition zone the outside sect disciples were in before the big competition started. At that time, Zhao Qingtian was a little puzzled. Why did Yi Lingyun ask about that? Now, it seemed that it was because of Victor. If he guessed correctly, Yi Lingyun had specially come to Heavenly Sword Mountain to watch the competition because of Victor. A dignified elder of Green Dragon Mountain, a foundation establishment stage cultivator, had used a large number of spirit stones to open a teleportation spell to come to the Heavenly Illusion Mystic Realm. It was actually for a ninth dot level spirit gathering stage disciple from the outside world. This was too absurd. How old is Victor? Zhao Qingtian used his spiritual power to ask the attendant. Replying sect master, 15 years old. 5 years old, ninth level of the spirit gathering realm. This talent would probably be a mixed spirit root talent. This talent might be considered good in the Heavenly Sword Mountain, but it was absolutely not enough in the Green Dragon Mountain. It was absolutely impossible for an elder to come personally. This meant that there were some other hidden characteristics on Victor's body that Yi Lingyun had seen, which he knew nothing about. When he realized this, Zhao Qingtian's expression became even more unsightly. Could it be that this Green Dragon Mountain was here to steal disciples? Although Green Dragon Mountain was a fourth dot grade mystic realm sect, one level stronger than my Heavenly Sword Mountain, they still couldn't bully people like this, right? This was still a competition in my Heavenly Sword Mountain. What's wrong, Sect Master Zhao? Yi Lingyun saw that Zhao Qingtian's complexion wasn't too good and asked with a smile. She had already noticed the departure of Zhao Qingtian's attending and vaguely guessed what had happened. Zhao Qingtian forced a smile and said in a deep voice, It seems that fellow Taoist Yi knows this outer sect disciple, right? That's not the case. It's just a few reasons. Victor has a very deep relationship with our Green Dragon Mountain, and I came here on behalf of the Great Elder. Green Dragon Mountain's Great Elder. Zhao Qingtian almost fell from his seat. The Great Elder that Yi Lingyun spoke of could only be one person, and that was the current master of the Green Dragon Mountain's Holy Daughter. He was skilled in prophetic techniques and had an extremely high status. He is the future master of the Green Dragon Mountain sect master. He didn't expect that it would be Victor who the great elder of Green Dragon Mountain would personally pay attention to. How could Victor know the great elder of Green Dragon Mountain? With such a status, many people looked up to him. Wait, prophecy. Could it be that Victor's shadow appeared in the prophecy of the great elder of Green Dragon Mountain? Zhao Qingtian knew that the Holy Son and Daughter of Green Dragon Mountain all had all top dot grade spirit roots. They had dual spiritual roots and had an extremely high affinity of 70%. The Green Dragon Mountain had wind, water, and wood attributes. The Son had wind, and the Daughter had water. These two siblings were at the twelfth level of the spirit gathering realm at the age of 15. They had broken through in three years and reached the foundation establishment stage at the age of 18. With such monstrous cultivation talent compared to the selection of the Heavenly Sword Mountain's geniuses, they were like children playing house in the eyes of people from the Green Dragon Mountain. Thinking of Green Dragon Mountain, Zhao Qingtian really couldn't muster up the courage to fight back. If any of the elders of Green Dragon Mountain were to be placed in the Heavenly Sword Mountain, it would be difficult even if he were to personally take action. Zhao Qingtian was currently thinking about what he should do if the Green Dragon Mountain really didn't care about the pride of a large sect and recruited people from their Heavenly Sword Mountain. Come to think of it, Victor was only a participant and not a disciple of his Heavenly Sword Mountain. If the Green Dragon Mountain really showed interest in recruiting Victor, he would definitely choose them. After all, the resources of the Green Dragon Mountain were more abundant. Letting out a heavy breath, Zhao Qingtian said, Fellow Taoist Yi, 
your purpose for coming to Heavenly Sword Mountain this time isn't simple, right? Yi Lingyun chuckled. Sect Master Zhao seems to be worried about something. Zhao Qingtian said with a sullen face, Victor is a disciple who came to participate in our Heavenly Sword Mountains competition. But as far as I know, he is currently only a disciple of the outside world's Qingyun sect, Zhao Qingtian frowned and did not refute. This was naturally not the time to be embarrassed by his previous bragging. After a moment of silence, Zhao Qingtian felt that something was wrong. If the Green Dragon Mountain had long noticed Victor, they would have gone to the Qingyun sect to rope him in. Why would they let Victor participate in the Heavenly Sword Mountain's grand competition? A foundation establishment pill was probably nothing to the Green Dragon Mountain. Zhao Qingtian couldn't figure this out, so he didn't ask. At this moment, Yi Lingyun said, Actually, our elder doesn't want to recruit from your Heavenly Sword Mountain. In fact, I came to the Heavenly Sword Mountain this time for another important matter to discuss. Hearing Yi Lingyun's serious tone, Zhao Qingtian sat up straight. Please speak, fellow Taoist Yi, that this matter is of great importance, and I can't explain it within a short while. We'll discuss it in detail after the grand competition ends. Such a solemn expression made Zhao Qingtian feel a little uneasy. However, he did not continue to ask. Everything would come to a conclusion after the competition was over. After Victor and Jiang Wang's battle, the bet on the number one person from the external sex had come to an end. Victor had won the championship ahead of time. As for the other matches in Victor's group, there was no suspense at all. Many opponents had given up on fighting Victor in order to preserve their strength and enter the second dot tier team. Victor won three then four matches in a row, and only met Ding Ling in the fifth match. As one of the contestants who had won all the matches, Ding Ling naturally had the strength. However, against Jiang Wang, she was defeated in two moves. The people who had defeated her in an instant were all defeated by Victor. Chapter 79 I Can Win The Confidence of the Strong You are listening at Novel Full Dot Audio. Chapter 79 I can win. The confidence of the strong. Ding Ling knew very well how big the gap between her and Victor was. But even so, she did not want to admit defeat. Her position in the second dot tier team was secure. She did not want to go down without a fight. This was not in line with her nature. After the match began, Ding Ling did not hide herself because she knew very well that her invisibility spell was useless in front of Victor. Invisibility was only a self-deception. She pulled out a long sword, and dozens of light blades appeared behind her. Take my full dot strength attack, light blade kill. Whoosh whoosh whoosh. Dozens of light blades followed Ding Ling's long sword and attacked Victor from all directions. Victor stopped in his tracks and appeared in front of Ding Ling like a ghost. Lion King Fist The illusion of a wild lion appeared from Victor's fist and suddenly rushed toward Ding Ling's position. The result was obvious. Victor wins. The referee announced. Ding Ling's eyes were still in a daze. The lion's roar seemed to still be ringing in her ears. It was only after the fight that she came back to her senses. Facing Victor who was charging towards her, she was like a child facing a ferocious beast. She had no strength to resist. At this point, Victor had won all five rounds. It was certain that he would be able to enter the first dot tier team. He's too strong. In my impression, other than Ji Mengyun, no one else had been able to fight Victor for more than ten minutes. Most of the battles were settled with a few moves. It seems that Victor must have hidden his strength when fighting with Ji Mengyun. Although it was expected for Victor to defeat Ding Ling, the fact that he could win so easily still made the surrounding audience gasp in admiration. Next round, Jiang Wang vs Huang Qi Huang Qi was tacitly recognized as the first in the group. Before Huang Qi entered the arena, he did not look at his opponent Jiang Wang. Instead, he looked at Victor with a faint smile. 
as a disciple of an external sect, you're not bad. You have a small chance to enter the top 10. You can be my opponent in the next grand competition. Next competition. Victor smiled slightly. These disciples of the Heavenly Sword Mountain were more confident than the others. They had grown up as a genius. Moreover, they were the personal disciples of the Peak Master of the Spirit Spell Peak. It was no wonder that they had a strong sense of superiority in their bones. That's right. In the next competition, you are still too weak. Although your combat experience is not bad, and your martial arts techniques have been trained to a very high level, your strength is still too weak. To be able to reach the ninth level of the spirit gathering realm, it should be enough for you to be proud. In Huang Qi's opinion, this was already an extremely high evaluation from him. Huang Qi noticed Victor's neutral expression and couldn't help but felt a little displeased. It seems like you're not convinced by what I said. It's the first time a disciple from an external sect participated in the grand competition. To be able to get a spot in the top 20 is indeed a top-notch talent. You're also considered qualified to be my opponent. However, you're only qualified to be my opponent. It might not be the case if you're up against a few other people. Victor was slightly stunned. The personal disciple of the Peak Master of the Heavenly Sword Mountain Spirit Spell Peak. His pride was extremely high. Obviously, Huang Qi was definitely a person with ambition. However, after listening to his words, he faintly felt that he was inferior to the other disciples. Since he implied that the other people he mentioned were definitely on a higher level than him. Huang Qi finished talking and jumped onto the arena and extended a finger towards Jiang Wang. The winner will be decided within a minute. Victor had defeated Jiang Wang in less than five minutes. Huang Qi had set a time limit of one minute, which was only one fifth of Victor's time. This could be considered as a show of strength. These Heavenly Sword Mountain disciples were all young and full of vitality, naturally, they did not want to be outdone by a cultivator from an outside sect. Huang Qi, go for it. Defeat him with one punch. As soon as Huang Qi finished speaking, the audience below the stage burst into cheers. This was the home ground of the Heavenly Sword Mountain, and there were many disciples of the Spirit Spell Peak around. As the personal disciple of the Peak Master of the Spirit Spell Peak, Huang Qi had a wide circle of friends in the peak, naturally, there were many disciples who supported him. Jiang Wang looked at Huang Qi expressionlessly. His body was covered by a thick layer of golden protective shield, which was even thicker than when he fought against Victor. He was using his actions to face Huang Qi's contempt for him. He knew that he was not as good as Huang Qi, but it would not be so easy as to defeat him in under a minute. Let the match begin. The referee announced. Huang Qi took out a black ruler sword. As he waved it rapidly, countless strange runes flowed on the black ruler sword. In less than three seconds, hundreds of runes appeared around Jiang Wang's body. Three seconds later, Huang Qi put his hands together, and hundreds of runes imprinted on the protective barrier around Jiang Wang. Crack. The protective barrier seemed to be tightly bound by an invisible chain. It was violently deformed. Jiang Wang's face turned pale, and the spiritual power in his body surged. In that instant just now, his protective barrier almost broke. Eh. Huang Qi was surprised. The toughness of the other party's protective barrier had exceeded his expectations. Suppress Eddie Ed Huang Qi pointed with his finger, and countless runes connected with each other like light swords. The sword stabbed into Jiang Wang's protective shield, making it look like a hedgehog. Jiang Wang clenched his teeth. He only defended and not attack. He pushed the spiritual power in his body to the limit. He was determined to hold on for one minute even at the expense of his life. Although his protective shield had not been broken, hundreds of light swords had already passed through the protective shield and slowly pressed down on him. In a few more seconds, Jiang Wang would be cut into pieces. Huang Qi wins. Following the referee's announcement, exactly 30 seconds had passed. 
Ha, huh, as expected of a core disciple of the spirit spell peak. Senior brother Huang is so powerful. Enthusiastic applause sounded from below the stage, especially from the disciples of the spirit spell peak. Many female disciples screamed in shock, obviously very satisfied with Huang Qi's performance. Jiang Wang removed his protective shield and walked off the stage amidst the cheers for Huang Qi. He felt an indescribable sense of loss. Was the gap really that big? By chance, he looked up and saw Victor standing with his hands behind his back, looking at him with a calm expression. He had seen Huang Qi's powerful strength, but he could still maintain such a calm expression. What kind of trump card did he have? Could he deal with Huang Qi? Jiang Wang found it unbelievable. They were both outer sect disciples, so why did he have such confidence? Are you all right? Victor could also imagine Jiang Wang's current mood. He had tried his best, but he was still being eaten alive by his opponent. As the disciple in which the Ueloan sect had taken pride in, the blow that Jiang Wang had received was unimaginable. Jiang Wang stubbornly shook his head. Victor smiled and turned to leave. He was only expressing his polite condolences as a former opponent. Victor, why are you so confident? Jiang Wang asked with a complicated look in his eyes. I can win. Victor was slightly startled, smiled brightly, and nodded. He didn't even say who he wanted to win. Chapter 80 Asking me to draw my sword, do you think you're worthy? You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. Chapter 80 Asking me to draw my sword, do you think you're worthy? Jiang Wang was stunned. This was an absolutely confident answer. From his tone, it seemed that even Huang Qi was only a small goal. Could it be that his goal was to be in the top five? Or the top three? However, the Ueluan sect had already been defeated, and Jiang Wang's older brother, Jiang Yun, had also been defeated. There were fewer and fewer disciples from the outside world now. You can do it. Jiang Wang had thought it through. He had already gained a lot by coming here, so there was no need to worry about it. Okay. Victor casually agreed. For him, the competition had just begun. Huang Qi had already hinted that the strength of the seven personal disciples was indefinite, and there was a big gap between them. Huang Qi even admitted that some of them were superior to him. Three days later. The sun had yet to rise, and the sky was only just beginning to brighten. Many people had already gathered in the square in front of the Heavenly Sword Mountain. The peak masters of the various peaks of the Heavenly Sword Mountain, the teachers of the ten great cultivation families, the sect masters or elders of the external sects, and many disciples. The standard of this year's grand competition should be the highest compared to the past three years. Of course. Didn't you see that even the Green Dragon Mountain sent an envoy? I heard that the people from the Green Dragon Mountain came here for a special purpose. They didn't come specifically to watch our grand competition, I don't know about that. Speaking of which, how's the ranking of your illusionary sword peak? Uh. It's alright. The sun finally rose slowly. The referee for the final match was already standing in the center of the field. This person was in the intermediate stage of the Foundation Establishment Realm. He was one of the inner elders of the Heavenly Sword Mountain. After the rules were read out, the finals officially began. The voice of the referee was extremely loud, and the entire field could clearly hear his voice. Victor, just try your best. If you can't beat your opponent, don't try to be brave, don't let yourself get hurt. Song Xiuwen sent Victor to the contestant area and repeatedly instructed. I understand. Victor walked to the participant area and sat down on a chair. The first match soon began. The participants were neither seated nor core disciples of other peaks. Although it was a fierce fight, the audience was obviously disappointed. While the intense fight was ongoing, a handsome man holding a folding fan suddenly sneered at Victor. You're Victor. I'm Nangong Zifeng, 
the core disciple of the Heavenly Sword Mountain's Molten Spirit Peak. I don't think I know you. It's okay if you don't know me. I know who you are. Because of you, my brother missed this important competition. Victor remembered the kid he defeated at the East Ocean restaurant. His name was Nan Gong Outian. However, Victor didn't hit him too hard at that time. It was entirely Nan Gong Outian's own fault that he suffered such a serious injury. Sensing the intense hostility of Nan Gong Zifeng, Victor said coldly, the reason your brother was injured to such extent was because he used a move that he couldn't control and suffered a backlash. It had nothing to do with me. Nothing to do with you. Oomph, if it wasn't for your attack, how could my brother's ash black flame lose control? So you're saying that I should stretch my neck and wait for your brother's attack? What if I'm not strong enough to deal with his ash black flame? Wouldn't I be burnt to ashes? Nangong Zifeng laughed out loud, this world is originally a world of strength. Whoever is stronger will set the rules. I'm stronger than you, so naturally, I'll be the one to set the rules. You think you are stronger than me? Victor smiled faintly. We will know very soon. Our battle will begin in the fourth round. After saying that, Nangong Zifeng left in large strides. At the same time, the outcome of the competition on the stage had already been decided. Very soon, a few matches passed just like that. There were no famous people on the stage. In the fourth round, Victor faced Nangong Zifeng. Nangong Zifeng was the third dot ranking disciple of the Molten Spirit Peak, and he had won all of the group matches. Victor had won all of them, but... In the eyes of the audience, although Victor was a genius, compared to the seven personal disciples, there was still a huge gap. During the preliminaries, Victor defeated Jiang Wang in two moves but wasn't credited with many points. After all, Jiang Wang had no hope of entering the top 20 thus defeating Jiang Wang didn't mean anything. However, the higher dot-ups of the Heavenly Sword Mountain were paying close attention to this match. They paid special attention to Victor. Victor was terrifyingly young. Especially the sect master of the Heavenly Sword Mountain, Zhao Qingtian. He had already sent people to investigate Victor's past. After this investigation, Zhao Qingtian was even more shocked. Victor was actually a commoner cultivator who rose up in the Qingyun sect without any background. It was simply incredible that he achieved such a result. After Nangong Zifeng entered the arena, it immediately attracted the cheers of many disciples, especially some female disciples who did not have many talents. They were continuously cheering. These people had limited talent and had always dreamed of marrying core disciples. However, core disciples like the Sword Control Peak and Sword Forging Peak were either focused on cultivation or focused on their sword forging skills. There was no hope of getting close to those disciples. With that, the disciples of the Molten Spirit Peak would naturally be in great demand. Compared to Nangong Zifeng, Victor's cheers were much lesser. Nangong Zifeng and Victor looked at each other. Nangong Zifeng sneered, I heard that you haven't drawn your sword yet. You're hiding your trump card. Now that you're facing me, I advise you not to hold back. If you have any moves, you'd better use them as soon as possible. Otherwise, you won't stand a chance. I don't intend to hide my trump card. I'm just looking for the need to use it. Oomph, you're really extremely arrogant. I've fought all the way here, but only one person managed to force me to draw my sword. I want to see what kind of trump card you have to let you have the guts to say such words. As Nangong Zifeng spoke, he took out a green longsword from his storage ring. The sword faintly emitted a faint spiritual power fluctuation. Victor smiled. You want me to unsheath my sword? Let's see if you have the ability to make me unsheath the sword first. Victor narrowed his eyes. Then, a sword light appeared in his eyes. Nangong Zifeng had long anticipated that Victor would use his sword force to attack. He sneered and shook his wrist. Countless ghostly sounds could be heard coming from the blade of the sword. They were like the flames of hell. 
Victor's attack was blocked by these flaming ghosts. Bang bang bang. The flaming ghosts that were broken by the sword energy expanded like a balloon and exploded. However, as soon as the flaming ghosts had exploded, a new flaming ghost appeared. Victor's sword force had broken more than ten of them at once, but even so, it still couldn't reach Nangong Zifan. If you are only using your sword force to attack, then you'll disappoint me. As Nangong Zifeng spoke, dark red flames appeared all over his body. The flames burned fiercely, and the tongues of flames shot out to several feet high, enveloping Nangong Zifeng within. Ash Black Flame Victor easily recognized this move. Back in the East Ocean restaurant, Nangong Aotian had also used it, and he had suffered a great loss because of it.